So I'm going to close this back out. Since there's only two accounts affected, let's use the register method. So I'm going to go back and then go to the tab to the left. And we're going to go into our chart of accounts, accounting on the left hand side and chart of accounts. If you're in the business view, by the way, the chart of accounts, in case you were wondering, although I'm sure you know by now, if you've been following along, it's in the bookkeeping and then the chart of accounts. And then we're going to go to the chart of accounts, close this back out. Now these are both balance sheet accounts, so I can open up either uh, of them using the register. So I think the easy one might be the long term because I need to bring it back to zero. So that's this one down here. So I'm going to go into the register related to my loan and I'm just going to reverse the journal entry I did before bringing it back to zero. So I'm going to go drop down journal entry 030123 and we'll do this is going to be called a reversing entry and this is going to be a decrease for that same amount which I could find here or I can find there. I'm just going to reverse that so it goes back to one account with the total of the 698813. So we're going to say, all right, this is going to be 56769.59 uh, decrease. And the other side going to loan, loan payable, and the chase loan for the short term, current liabilities. There it is. Mui B to the N. Let's go ahead and run it. Running. I was running.